Hello everybody, and welcome back to Surfout Collectibles. Today we're going to be taking a look at some video game systems freshly graded and back from VGA. Now, these are going to be the same video game systems that you saw us highlight in our August 16th video. If you watched that video, you know that we purchased a group from a private collector, a group of uh, video game consoles. They were factory sealed. So we actually sent those game consoles in to VGA. That was in August. So this is the end of September. So they got them back to us very quickly. So we're super excited that they got them back so quick and we haven't even checked our grades online. So today will be the first day we actually get to see the grades as well. They're still in their factory sealed boxes. They still got their fragile stickers all over them. So we, we don't even know what's inside these boxes. So super excited to see the grades we got on these. We should have a Game Boy and a Game Gear in the small box here. And I imagine the Mac Daddy, the uh, Turbo Duos in the big box. So let's go ahead and cut into these things and see what kind of grades we got out of those game systems. Super excited. All right. Oh yeah, I forgot that uh, VGA uses all the peanuts here. Let's try not to make a mess. All right, here we go. An alien egg. Let us see what we got out of these. This will be the Game Gear and the Game Boy. Both of these are from the early production runs. You guys know the Game Boy came out in 1989. Had an introductory price of about 90 bucks. So very affordable, became one of the best selling game consoles of all time. I think it sold 118 million copies. Game Gear came out in 1991, much shorter lifespan, but still sold about 10 million copies. All right, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and leave the, the VGA bags on these. It helps cut out the studio glare. We're gonna set these aside, not take a look at the grades just yet. Let's clean up the table here a little bit. Okay, get this here out of the way. <clears throat> All right, let's see what we got. First one will be the Game Boy. All right, big reveal. You know, we're pretty happy with that grade. It's an 80 plus. 80 plus on the factory sealed Game Boy from 1989. That is a great grade for that game, uh, for that system. Oh, that's excellent. And as I mentioned in the August 16th video, if you haven't had a chance to look at that, this is the, the version with the boy in the red shirt and the yellow Tetra screen. There is a blue shirt boy as well. It's a different version. But this here is the early production run, 80 plus, near mint for the Game Boy from 1989. Super happy about that grade. That's a good one. All right, so the Game Gear. Let's see what we have on the Game Gear. All right, here we go. An 80 plus, that is fantastic. I was worried about that one because there was a little bump or two on it, but I guess that's all they saw. So this is, once again, the 1991 version. Sega Game Gear. This has the game columns in it. It's an 80 plus, a near mint. Excellent. All right. So now we just got the, the big, the big Mac Daddy here. Let's go ahead and move these aside. See if we can get into this box. This will be the Turbo Duo from NEC. This one here may make a mess. Okay. <clears throat> that is a <laughs> that is a lot of peanuts stuck to. The... All right. Studio crew is going to have fun cleaning this mess up. Okay, 
let us take a look at this guy. The Turbo Duo. This was from 1992, was when they launched it in LA. Had a nationwide rollout in 1993. Only ran for a few years. So not a whole, not a whole lot of these were sold. And if you remember the, uh, if you guys watched the August 16th video that we posted, these do not come factory sealed in, in cellophane. So this is very, very tough to find factory sealed, very rare console. Okay, that should be good. But let's go ahead and peel this off. Okay, and here we go. What did we get for this one? A 75. If you guys remember this particular console, let me move these here aside. This particular console had a, a tear in the cellophane. Where was that tear? Oh, right here. Had a tear in the cellophane. So we didn't expect a super high grade on this, but a 75, you know, that's, that's better than we hoped for actually. We thought it was gonna grade a little lower. So a 75 for the Turbo Duo. This came out in 1992, as it states here on the label. This was a 75. Has five games inside. Fantastic, you know, we're super happy with that grade. Like I said, we didn't think we were gonna get a, such a good grade on this because of the tear in the cellophane. But there you have it. <clears throat> our Game Gear, our Game Boy, and our Turbo Duo, all freshly graded from VGA. Please feel free to leave some comments in the comment section below. Let us know what you thought about this video. Let us, let us know what you think about our grades. And also let us know if you guys are grading any of these game systems or these handhelds. We're really interested to see what you guys are sending in and what grades you're getting. Also give us a thumbs up if you liked the video. And as always, please remember to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you for joining us here at Certified Collectibles and we'll see you again next time.